welcome back to my channel fabulous Bree here and I am back with another video and this time if you haven't seen from the title of this video yes I have in some new hair <laughs> um if you don't know by now I am kind of obsessed with hair I'm obsessed with like weave and just you know protective styling don't get me wrong I love my natural hair I love my hair but y'all it's just some about weave like it just gives me that extra you know mm, like confidence you know what i'm saying <laughs> like not saying i don't have confidence with my natural hair but i'm just saying it just makes me feel like some type of way when i have been some some long luscious weave or whatever but um anyways this video is about my wig that i have on this is a 360 um lace frontal wig um i did receive this from a company called wow ebony they are they are on instagram and i think they are in aliexpress space company i'm not too sure i don't think well i don't know but, um if you follow me on some of my social platforms i did kind of showcase this hair um the other day um i let some of you guys know well not some of you guys i let all of you guys know that i did not do the glue down method this time with the got to be glued um, if you've seen my routine on how I lay down my wigs, um, I always use the got to be glued and the spray, the got to be free spray, glued free spray thing. Um, these are really good things to use if you're looking for something that's going to hold your hair down for like a good week. But me being me, I be, I, I be wanting my hair to like lay down for like a month because I, I don't be wanting to deal with my hair underneath like I normally like when I used to get like sew ins and like full weaves or whatever I wouldn't take it out until like a month later <laughs> and I know some of you guys may hear that and think it's disgusting but it's totally fine like don't nothing be wrong with my hair I just have like like a lot of hair growth from underneath and you know of course it does get a little dirty from like dandruff and scratching but um I do give my hair like a really good wash and we good to go for the next month if I want to put on some more hair or whatever the case may be and I didn't get a chance to like really just wash it the way that I wanted to all I did was like a quick like I wet it down and I put in a couple of products I guess the only product that I used was from Shea Moisture this is the coconut and hibiscus frizz free curl mousse so I use this to because this is like a free part frontal so I can like part it on the side or do whatever I want I try to pluck a middle part but you guys when it comes to like customizing frontals or wigs or whatever the case may be I suck so I just kind of plucked it a little bit and then I went in with like a little bit of concealer just to make that look a little bit more natural like the part I mean it was kind of light right there but I wanted it to actually look like a scalp and I did record the process of me sewing down my hair like braiding it down and everything so if you're interested in seeing it I am going to add that on the um end of this video on the technique that i did this time okay so i have in the 180 percent density indian remy hair it is a 360 lace wig loose curl that's what it says um so it is a curly wig but it's more of a loose curl loose wave so let me repeat that again i have in a uh, 180 180 percent density indian remy hair 360 lace wig loose curls so yeah and this is on wow ebony and you know when you go on the website if you ever went on a wig website they always ask for the length hair color part design and your cap size so for the length i did choose 24 but they didn't have any more in stock so i got a 22 inch the hair color i got is a 1b off black color and the part design is a free part because I wanted to be able to wear it down the middle, wear it to the side or whatever the case may be. And the cap size that I got is a medium or average size. So yeah, that is all my information, but I will be sure to have a link down in the description box too. So if you are interested in this style, in this exact wig, I will have everything in the description box link directly to the wig but if you just want to go on there and browse and look at the other wigs that they have then definitely click on the link below to their website straight to the website 
yeah hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope i gave you enough information on my hair and yeah and i hope you learned a new technique today on how to lay down your wig if you don't want to use any of the glue or the got to be glued or whatever the case may be so yeah just uh continue watching this video for me mm-hmm <laughs>